Okay, evil lovers, I kind of found like uh, 15 minutes of my precious Skagen broken watch time. Yeah, before I have to pick up uh, my monsters and put them there. Hmm. Okay, uh, we made a consumption test, comparison, whatever you want to call it, uh, on highway speeds for uh, this thing here called Tesla S, Bella, Bella, Ciao Bella, uh, Kia Soul, where is it? Yeah, here. And uh, my little thingy that's called Ionic. Yeah, Ionic. Why did we do it? Well, because we had too much time, we wanted to have fun which we actually did and we i have a little fetish on comparing stuff so yeah why not um where we did it we did it in our beautiful slovenia it's a little country it's down of austria and near italy and croatia it's like that big okay check it out uh, we went from ljubljana to maribor ljubljana is our capital city uh, route details will be down in there in the description. I'll post all the numbers also there so you can check it out. Okay, uh, along the route we had few roadworks, uh, some tunnels with speed li limits of course, uh, lots of traffic, lots of grandmoms behind the wheel, uh, there was rain too, not ideal conditions, that, but well, we tested that, it's not ideal and the speeds, yeah. So, um, before I post the numbers, I'm gonna say that I'm from, I live in EU, you know, so I'm gonna use the metric system, I think, uh, and I'm gonna use kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers and Celsius degrees, yeah, of course. Cool. So, uh, distance that we traveled was 120 kilometers, uh, we did it in one hour and ten minutes, with, which was not that bad. Considering that, as I mentioned, we had the roadworks, grandmas, uh, rain. Um, there was uh, the, the temperature outside was, check it, uh, 29 degrees. So we had to use our air conditioning systems. We put, uh, uh, we put it to 23 degrees Celsius. Yeah, good. And uh, just to say, we drove mostly when we could, safely, of course. Uh, we drove over the 130 kilometers because um, who the hell drives 90 kilometers per hour uh, on highway? I don't know the guy. Yeah, I know them. I'm kidding. Uh, leaf owners. <laughs> don't hate me. I had to. Okay, so um, yeah, battery battery statuses were like 65% uh, for Tesla on the end. Ionic had 43% and Kia had 28%. Consumption figures were 19.2 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers for Tesla. Yeah, Kia ate uh, 18.3 and Ionic ate 13.9 kilowatt hours per 100 kilometers. That's pretty low. Yeah. Uh, if I think about the differences, we have to take into the consideration that Tesla is 2.5 tons car, you know, that's pretty heavy. Uh, Soul is about one ton lighter, you know, they have like pretty similar, they had pretty similar uh, consumptions, you know. So, uh, because Soul was made by hamsters, designed by hamsters that like bricks, <laughs> uh, you can see how much the aerodynamics actually affects the consumption, you know. Um, so that's pretty much, yeah, interesting fact. Because Ionic is pretty much the same weight as uh, Kia Soul is, uh, but because of the aerodynamics, uh, this speed had way lower consumption. I mean, we all know that Ionic is the king of efficiency. Mm -hmm. Oh, and because I'm not a big I'm gonna say a big thank you to Lidl because uh, we used their chargers to fill our batteries you know they uh, let people to charge for free uh, so uh, Lidl again thank you yeah okay on this note I'm gonna uh, end I'm gonna let you guys to discuss uh, the numbers to maybe con debate um, what affects consumption more is it 
the brick shape of sole or is it the weight of Tesla? Uh, what matters most? More, let's say, yeah. Uh, next test I'm gonna do is the same cars but in winter time. Uh, um, way below the zero, I hope. And it will be interesting to see if Kia can actually make it to the... the, the I mean, if Kia can actually make the same route at same speeds because consumption figures will be probably way up higher. Okay, um, so that's it. See ya!